Madam Speaker, today is World AIDS Day. And lest we forget, it is not over yet. In 2021, 1.5 million persons became infected with AIDS and 600,000 died. A pandemic or an epidemic. As we fought and scurried to save lives against COVID-19, let us not forget. I rise to thank all of the aid advocacy groups and my particular center, the Thomas Street Clinic, which will hold a World AIDS Day ceremony today, one that I never miss except when in Washington. I remember the days of standing at the bedsides of those who are dying alone. We must continue to research, we must continue to acknowledge, and we must continue to eliminate the stigma for all of those infected and affected with AIDS must have human dignity. I'm reminded of my early engagement standing with the late Senator Orrin Hatch uh, and, of course, Ted Kennedy when they announced the Ryan White Treatment Act. And what an amazing impact. We've lost many souls. Many families have suffered. But as Americans, let us continue to fight against the scourge of AIDS and to embrace those who are fighting and living with AIDS. World AIDS Day, we should never expired. forget it is not over yet. I yield back.